Today's edition of Off the Menu is sponsored by the St. Louis Science Center. Hey, it's St. Louis Post-Dispatch restaurant critic Ian Frobe with Off the Menu. This week, I visit Rice Thai Bistro, which opened a year ago on Manchester Road in Winchester. Now, it's a tiny restaurant in a small strip mall, the kind of place you could drive by a hundred times and never notice, but it's worth seeking out. The owners and chefs are a married team, Brian and Ina Pia Paisilpa. Uh, Brian told me when I interviewed him for the review that he learned to cook as a teenager because, as with teenagers across the world, he and his friends like to get together and drink, and a big part of the drinking culture there is to get together and drink and eat. So by learning to cook, he made himself especially valuable to his group of friends. Now the menu doesn't differ much from other Thai restaurants in town. It's your basic layout of curries, wok fry noodles, and so forth, even crab rangoon. Uh, more on that in a bit. Uh, but what really struck me was the vibrancy of the flavors. Uh, the green curry you see here was one of the best curry dishes I've had in town. Just the perfect balance of sweetness from coconut milk, chili heat, um, all the different uh, herbs and spices used in the green curry base. Uh, just a wonderful dish. You see here uh, slices of barbecue pork over rice and a cucumber relish. Uh, it looks like a simple dish, but again, the flavors are very complex. In fact, it's actually a two sauce dish. It comes in a sauce that's basically its own juices, lightened with uh, soy sauce. Then on the side is a sauce that adds the chili heat, the sweetness, um, all those, again, complex, vibrant notes you want from Thai cuisine. Now, I mentioned the crab rangoon. You see it here. It looks, it should look different from most other crab rangoon. Uh, they use rice paper instead of wonton. They roll into a, a long cylindrical tube. And this isn't just different for difference sake. Um, it actually, I thought, worked better. You get a closer to even ratio in each bite of that crunchy exterior to the cream cheese filling. Uh, really a fun dish. Uh, rice Thai Bistro, again, I hate to, to use a cliche, but it is a hidden gem worth seeking out. Uh, you can read my entire review on sdltoday.com or pick up a copy of Go Magazine this weekend. And I'll be back next week with more Off the Menu. They're here. Are you ready? Robots at the St. Louis Science Center Omnimax Theater. 